And that's his lap. Eight so slower it, than Daniel Abt. Oof. Yeah, that's not a neat lap for Mitch Evans. Sims goes 1.4 seconds slower than that. Actually, that's a reasonably good lap time for Daniel Abt. The quickest lap times we've seen are sort of a 1 minute 9.0 from the Sim races. So that's going to put Abt there or thereabouts, I would have thought, in the battle for the top. Good effort, Daniel Abt. <laughs> With eight tenths, Jack. Nearly nine tenths. That's impressive. But Daniel has admitted to being lost at times with his sim racing business. He's obviously. Uh, you see, da Daniel Abt is still. Uh, <laughs> he's practicing hard. Um, obviously, a front row start. He's got to be delighted with his qualifying performance. That was really quite impressive. Sam Bird sent me a picture of him relaxing on the sofa a couple of minutes ago. So he's maybe not. Uh, he's now taking it seriously. I think he's going to push him again, Jack. He's just, he's not happy with getting nudged out of the, of the race lead. And he's going to, I would imagine, have another go and dive bomb into turn six in a second. Just look at him lining up such a wide braking zone. Is he going to lunge again? Van Dorn defense the inside. Yep. There we go. Um, yeah, I mean, um, I, had a, I had an okay start. And then um, Daniel came up the inside. To be honest, I'm, I'm questioning uh, if it was really Daniel, right? Please ask uh, Daniel Ab to put his Zoom when, you know, next time he's driving, because uh, like Stoffel said, I'm pretty sure it wasn't him. Ah, oh, I see. So that's what we wondered what Stoffel meant when uh, we, were, we were puzzled when he said, was it actually oh, I Daniel Abt? I thought this was a I new knew personality. Stoffel was alluding to it. I absolutely <laughs> knew. Did, there was another picture when his face was blocked. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm with Stoffel. We all agree on that. So if, it, if it's possible, then I'm going to try and hire the, the best uh, scene driver, uh, gamers, and uh, this way it. I can uh, then come be back uh, and talk about <laughs> I love it. The competitive nature driver. Don't worry. We will do some investigation for you, Jean-Eric Byrne, and find out exactly what's going on. <laughs> Audi Formula E driver Daniel Abt was disqualified and ordered to pay €10,000 to charity on Sunday for getting a professional gamer to compete under his name in an official esports race. The German, who apologized for having called an outside help, was also stripped of all points won to date in the all-electric series race at home challenge which features drivers using simulators remotely. I did not take it as seriously as I should have, said the 27-year-old, accepting the punishment for sporting misconduct. I am especially sorry about this because I know how much work has gone into this project on the part of the Formula E organization. I am aware that my offense has a bitter aftertaste, but it was never meant with any bad intention. Pro gamer Lorenz Hoerzing, ABT's ringer, was disqualified from all future rounds of the separate challenge grid competition. The 15-lap race around a virtual Berlin Tempelhof track was won by Britain's Oliver Rowland for Nissan E, Dams with Belgian Stoffel van Dorn second for Mercedes. The eSports series features regular Formula E drivers competing from their homes in isolation and aims to provide some action for fans with racing on hold in real life due to the COVID-19 pandemic.